Okay guys, it's Felicia with Happy Back Living. Okay, so this will be a quick grocery haul. We are back and I need to clear that summer palette. Like all the deliciousness. Whew, I've been eating good. But I am going back to three meals a day, a pound of veggies a day, proteins, fruit, the whole shebang. So I just came back from the grocery store. I've got everything over on the table and I wanna show you guys what I got. All right, so let's just take a quick, woo, look at all of that deliciousness. How much you guys think it costs? Put it down in the comment section below. Let's go through it though. We'll make it quick. We've got some Clorox bleach, which was $8.99. Then, I remember the days, this was like 2 or $3. Then we've got ground turkey and chicken thighs, $11.68. And then more chicken thighs. This particular brand was buy one, get one. So $6.67 and $6.25. And these drumsticks were buy one, get one, um, $5.81 and 586 and then these were also buy one get one zoom out a little bit um so these were 537 and 548 and then these were marked down like for a quick sell so these drumsticks were 529 and then these were 518 and then these chicken thighs were ten seventy six. This um, pork six oh seven, six oh seven. Like like guys. So these were buy one get one, and the fact that I found them at the same exact price like that just made me so happy. <laughs> and then we've got some bananas and cauliflower because I'm going to make mashed cauliflower. And I also want to make a quick note. So I want to pop in real quickly. You guys are about to see some convenience items because it is Monday and I am just getting around to doing the meal prep. So sometimes you got to do what you got to do. So I'm short on time this week. So you're about to see, you're about to see some convenience items. So with that being said, um, yeah, we've got peppers and onion that are already chopped for $5 each. We talked about the cauliflower. I promise you this romaine was not open when I bought it. I ripped it trying to take it out of the bag. Um, so two packs of romaine and I already have some in the refrigerator to make my salads for tonight. So that's fine. And then some zucchini and squash, um, $5 each. Aluminum foil, steamed veggies. So, this is another convenience item. Um, like I said, I'm going back to a pound of veggies a day. This is already pre-chopped. Um, it was $14.99. And to be quite honest with you guys, when I, cause I was gonna buy all of these things individually, it was actually a better deal. And I know that doesn't sound legit, but in today's prices, I came out ahead by just buying it this way. I'm being honest on that one. Even with these, so two peppers were $3.99 and then one pepper by itself was $1.99. So I was just like, you know what, forget it. I'll just do that. And I also have some butter, cheese. There's two packs of that. And then I've never had this before. If you guys have had these before, let me know down in the comment section. Um, these are some cheese wraps. Like, I want to try these and see if I like it. Um, look, so I looked at the ingredients. So here are the ingredients. They don't look too bad. They don't look too bad. You can see uh, mozzarella cheese, skim milk, salt, cheese cultures, enzymes. I don't know what those are. I don't know. So I'll try them and I'll let you guys know my thoughts regarding them they're by the brand crystal farms we'll see we'll see okay so let's continue and like i mentioned some um broccoli steamers cream cheese 
broccoli steamers. These are organic nectarines. Organic plums. And apples. Fries. Um, mushrooms. Eggs. This is a creamy um, Chipotle ranch dressing. And then barbecue sauce. I bought two of those. And then blue cheese dressing. So I also got some Listerine. You guys, I have realized that I am a fan of the zero alcohol mouthwash. It is a game changer. So I bought two of those because they were buy one, get one 50% off. Hot sauce, um, chicken broth, two of those, some organic chicken broth, and then some diced tomatoes. I am going to toss this on top of some chicken thighs and like season the chicken thighs and put them in the oven. Um, coffee, these were buy one, get one, this brand but I also love my organic coffee K-Cups too, so that's that. And then more hot sauce. So this hot sauce by um, Sweet Baby Ray's, we've never had before. So I thought we'd try it in case we hate it. Good old Louisiana. And this was on sale, I think it was like $1.99. And then some half and half and ranch dressing. So, yeah, that is all. I think I showed you guys everything. That is the entire grocery haul for the week. Um, the meat, I think, will last longer than a week. But whenever meat is on sale, if I have it in the budget, I try to um, stock up as much as I possibly can. Um, because in the long run, it definitely saves me money. So the part that you guys probably want to know is how much this crap costs. Not crap, it's food. <laughs> Hold on, let me get the receipt. Okay, so I know that before they put in like all of the coupons and everything, it was like a little bit over $300. But we didn't save a ton, but we did get it down to $250.84. I don't know if you can see that there. But the good news is that on my next grocery haul, I have about $89 worth of points. So it should be almost a free or like half off grocery haul. So we'll see what happens. Um, what I will do is I'll go ahead and I'll prep some of the proteins for the week and then I'll insert video here just to kind of give you guys an idea as to what I plan to do with this food. So stay tuned for that. Oh, and you guys heard me say that I needed to clear my palate. So I haven't like been eating like sugar or any of that stuff, but I have not been sticking to three meals a day. And I also have not been eating like my pound of veggies a day. Um, so one thing I've noticed is that whenever I'm traveling, particularly with other people, I tend to um, adapt to their eating schedule and which is fine right like it's okay but i've got to learn how i don't even know so another thing that i like to do like whenever i'm on vacation is i like to eat the foods that i can actually eat like i truly truly enjoy them like for instance i love myself some nachos so i truly thoroughly enjoy my nachos however it used to be like oh when i'm on vacation i eat the foods that i want to eat well, girl, when you go on vacation back to back, <laughs> you probably shouldn't do that all the time. But we'll see. I'm going to get back on schedule this week and then it should be fine. Even though we do have one more vacation coming up. My husband and I are celebrating his birthday and our anniversary. But um, I think I have a little bit more control with that one. Anyways, let me show you guys what I got. Let me show you what I got. Oh, and this week, now that I'm back... So this week I cleared out my um, closet so you guys will see that video 
and then also we're gonna do a weigh-in by Friday I should be able to upload the weigh-in video all right let me flip the camera around and show you guys what I am preparing okay so I'm gonna toss the seasonings here I'll cook this and then once it's like you know pretty cooked then I'll add barbecue sauce to this one this one I'm gonna toss this is more of a lemon pepper mix um, and then I'm also gonna put one of these in there and then these um, I will toss all of them in one pan and kind of saute them and then use them during the week for um, like to combine with chicken or whatever so here's the finished product barbecue chicken for the fam regular chicken for me and whoever else wants to eat it So this is my lunch for today. Two drumsticks with some veggies and some ranch dressing. And here's my breakfast with an apple and the other apple is for lunch. Here is the bread that I eat. It's flourless. It's the Ezekiel bread. Um, yummy but kind of pricey but I don't eat bread all the time but when I want it this is what I have so I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video bye